Sagittarius. We have pure luggage is the ruin of the spirit. So maybe not overthink and not and be guided by your heart more than logic, okay? Because it's gonna ruin whatever it is that you're deciding or going for. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for my all my friends, family, students, uh, subscribers. Thank you so much. And for those of you who are new to my channel, welcome to my space. Please like, share, and subscribe so I can grow my channel. Saras Saraswati, the goddess of self-knowledge, the essence of who I am flows effortlessly into everything I create. So you're creating, okay? You know, sort of a fire sign, which is what you are. And if you come into your power, crown chakra, open. Uh, so also third eye, solar plexus, so being in your power. And then peer, uh, pillar of light, your vibration is rising. You are an oracle. So you're probably already aligned. You're awakened. Uh, you know, you're an oracle. All right. How lovely. You're leveling up. And then you have, which is this? This is Claire Cognizant, okay? You just know. Great awakening, walk in your truth, stand firm in your life. How can you trust yourself more? So trusting yourself more is about really, um, you know, trusting your intuition. So if you've just awoken, then the more you trust it and the more you trust, you, you believe in your intuition and do what you're guided, the better you get. And if you have already awoken, then this is a huge leveling up that you're having here possibly with the uh, portal coming in tomorrow. So use that to propel, you know, the manifestations, okay? You're very divinely guided. Have your guardian angels. Um, yeah, angels taking care of you. I don't know that I want this one. Okay. No, I don't want this one. Okay, reconciliation. So this is reconciliation with self, or this is a reconciliation with someone, okay? I don't believe in twin flames, but uh, if you do, then this might be a reconciliation with a twin flame. This might be a reconciliation with self and or uh, reconciliation with a soulmate. You have many soulmates. I don't like twin flames because twin flame is about finding your other half of your soul. And it just goes against everything that spirituality believes in. We're complete. We don't need anybody. So I sort of like stating that we have soulmates and that's what it is. Very powerful soulmates. Lady Venus downloads an understanding. Truth is being revealed. Deep insight are coming from heaven and the astral realm. So you're getting, you're having a lot of like dreams. I am a dream interpreter. So, you know, hit me up and I will tell you what they mean. Crown chakra is huge, uh, is huge. Also your throat chakra is also uh, opening up, okay? Um, also, you're probably doing astro travel, which means that during your sleep state, you're traveling. And then Saint Germain, karma releasing, be, move beyond drama, create your own path, make room for good energy. So that's what you're working on. And, um, you know, most definitely use the lion's gate to release that or to propel yourself to where you want to be or what it is that you're manifesting. Divine matrix, yeah. Huge um, uh, stability, okay? there is medicine in my shadow so huge um so lots of wisdom you probably come from uh you know healers uh ancestors that were healers shamans okay part of the reason that you're an oracle this is a beautiful read and you have 
here. Uh, trust the universe, first quarter of Aquarius. Beautiful. All right. So that concludes your oracles. Let's do your tarot. Hold on. This is for Sagittarius. You haven't been sleeping you've been up in your head about this although you're gonna be doing better okay in terms of sleep and releasing the anxiety and the overthinking this has to do with um, somebody that was very manipulative it was a huge burden and you feel like this was uh, in the past, you feel like this was a lost opportunity and or possibly you feel like it wasn't an opportunity you wanted to take. You're no longer waiting, okay? There might have been some ghosting in the past, either you or this person. You felt that this was a past soulmate, past love or childhood friend. Um, maybe someone that you worked with, okay? Or this could be work as well. This could be a boss. That has you that had you with lots of anxiety and you wanted a higher position and it didn't come through this can also mean that uh, there was some judgment call on whatever it is that you were dealing with it could be a job or a position or a job so um, you're trying to heal and you were very hopeful for this yeah it looks like it was a partnership of some sort okay it could have been a business or a numerous relationship that you thought was very happy it was committed you were very loving to this person or this person was very loving to you or it was a water sign but there started being a lot of conflict no communication huge burden maybe some ghosting because some truth came out about like uh, player energy or, or energy coming and going that was not victorious this hurt you tremendously and um you know it hurt your heart it was a huge tower moment and you left so there might have been uh, like someone moved out of a home or this could be for work um, someone had to move it could either have been like they were fired okay and they were betrayed or uh, there was an actual move of building there was some communication that came in through the net online or something like that about a destabilization all right something that went back and forth and something that finished that there was an ending to a commitment that you were very happy with or you had a lot of love in all right, there is um, some like uh, increase in money, some proposition or proposal, possibly um, some property as well that you've been waiting for and it's gonna speed up. Someone's coming back, they're gonna text you or DM you in some sort of social media, all right? But someone's very regretful and someone is guarded. Yeah, you, there was a separation or some legal issues and you felt like you were left on the cold and felt financially drained, all right? You were illuminated, okay? There was a lot of conflict and you left the conflict behind this uh, huge betrayal. This was some sort of karma that played out or some sort of, um, yeah, karma. You might be dealing with a Scorpio, Leo, I believe Aquarius. Um, you were expecting like uh, an apology or an offer of like love or like a date of some sort it never came. Someone released uh, a commitment or collaboration. All right. They might not be in a long term commitment anymore. They might be uh, single or thinking about it or wanting to be single. There wasn't any equal give and take. You might be dealing with the cancer. There was fear. All right. Uh, and things that you didn't see you weren't balanced at all or there was no balance in this relationship and that's why the separation came in. You were not happy in this relationship at all. All right, there was some deceit that you saw through and that was the betrayal. 
that you're sitting in your power and your strength. And with this ending, you might be dealing with a Scorpio or an Aries. There was a lot of confusion. There might have also been a lot of drinking. You're trying to manifest this, okay? You're no longer waiting. There might have been some justice or some legal action that was taken or some truth that you found out. Yeah, there might be some, uh, there might have been a third party mm -hmm. situation or like an endeavor um, that is taking place. Yeah, you're holding on or you were holding on, you put in a lot of time and effort or this person did and there was no solid offer that came. They were very emotionally detached and you waited for them or they are currently waiting for you to come back. This was very toxic, all right, and you released it. There might be an apology coming in but you don't see it and it's gonna be really um, create justice in this, okay? That's what's being manifested but you don't believe it, but there is love here, all right, from this person. It looks like they're getting a divorce or separation or there's some legal issues or like legacy or money that's involved or a family dynamic, all right? There's some truth that came out and there was like lack of um, you know, like uh, intuition that was given, but you're sitting really pretty and it was a no-win situation and you're gonna be uh, winning this even though it's like kind of like a no situation but you're gonna move ahead is what it looks like or this person hope this helped Sagittarius love and light